On the football field, Kendall Short is a big, slashing, bruising running back. Stays on his feet. He's in the end zone, and he never went down. It's kind of a complete contradiction to who he is off the football field. His Twitter bio probably gives that away. Just want to make the world a better place. And this is a story about putting your money where your mouth is. And the story begins just before winter break 2016. It was supposed to be a just a solo road trip for me just to create memories and you know just make experiences and I decided that you know maybe I can help some other people while I'm you know helping myself out. So for five days over the holidays Kendall Short traveled more than 700 miles starting in Kansas City in route to Memphis Tennessee and then New Orleans. Each stop came with a visit to each city's police and fire departments. Each visit came with a check. The feeling of giving, it's kind of like a high, I guess. Kendall raised more than $1,900 through a GoFundMe account. I visited the Kansas City Police Department and gave the portion of their funds to Alex's journey. The Memphis Police Association donation um, actually went to 101 children that had lost a family member to homicides in Memphis that year. To New Orleans, their donation actually went to um, the tuition assistance program for their new officers. The monetary donations, of course, won't move mountains. Don't shoot! Don't shoot! But in times of racial tensions between the public and the police, you can't put a value on symbolism. With the disconnect between the public and the police departments right now in America and, I mean, around the world, honestly. Um, you know, I want to let them know that there's still people out there that respect them, that understands that, yes, there's a few bad apples everywhere. This does hit close to home for the Missouri Western Junior. After graduation, Kendall plans to be a firefighter in his hometown of Kansas City. It's all about, you know, helping others. And his mother is a longtime member of the Kansas City Police Department. They're genuinely good people, so, um, you know, thought I could give back where the, I mean, it's, it's not a large portion of money, but you know, it was, it was something. 